Hey everybody, it's Jennifer Egbert from the Porchlight Group here in Boulder, Colorado, and I'm here today at Will Day's studio in Black Lab Sports to ask Will 20 questions. Come with me. Will, oh my God, I love <laughs> your studio. Thanks. How long have you been here now? Three and a half years. Whoa, what are you working on today? I'm working on a new piece that just restrips the canvas and um, using more gestural strokes. Wow, and what's the connection to your art? I'm, I'm just, I'm connecting back to nature here. I'm trying to get more grounded and using more fluid strokes. And how do you know when a work is finished? I, it just, it feels right. I don't want to touch it. And what's the most valuable piece of art to you? The most valuable piece of art to me is a watercolor that I created in seventh grade. And who is your, are your biggest influences? I would have to say, first of all, Kandinsky and my mom. Aw. And in Bo Indian Boulder? Yes, I'd have to give a shout out to Gail Falwell, who is my neighbor over here. She's a world-class sculptor. She's incredible. Amazing. We saw your TED Talk at CU about oh. finding creativity in the chaos. <laughs> uh, we had no idea you knew Arabic. <laughs> uh, that was a long wow. time ago. <laughs> <laughs> Will, how about it in Arabic? Will you tell us the key element to Ooh. finding creativity in the chaos. Get goosebumps. I would say it'd have to start with the, the word inshallah, which God willing, that would let creativity flow through you if you're in the right place. Oh, what a beautiful language. <laughs> Do you know any other languages? I, I know French. I was a French major in college. Bonjour, je m'appelle <laughs> Guillaume. Ça va? I love it. <laughs> <laughs> what was the best aspect of giving a TED Talk? Uh, putting yourself out there. Mm. And where is your favorite place you've visited? I would have to say, you know, Tunisia. Um, what places are still on your bucket list to visit? China and Israel. Wow. Any places in Boulder you need to go to? I think, yes. I have to go back to the, I have to go to the Fox Theater. I haven't seen a, have, a show in a long time. It's parenting, I'm telling yeah. you. <laughs> what brought you to Boulder? Uh, lifestyle change. How long ago? Almost 13 and a half years. Wow. What and are your favorite things to do in Boulder? Oh, boy. I like to, uh, obviously, like to hike. And uh, I like to just, you know, be connected with the community and be outdoors. Do I see dog beds over there? You, you see the dog beds? Is that, what does it say? Banksy but, and Pablo? Banksy and Pablo. Who do those belong to? The, this is my, these are my Boston Terriers. And, oh, my gosh. Uh, one is six and a half years old, one is a puppy six months, so. I love that. So what is the best part of your day, Will? Best part of my day is waking up next to my wife, Aww. Amy. And what is the best advice you've ever received? The best advice is you have to have faith. Wow, that's awesome. Do you have a life philosophy? Yeah, I would say, you know, walk in love and live in grace is what I think about, and those are words are, planted throughout my studio. I love it. One last question to it. wrap up for your fun here today. <laughs> any exciting news, any events, any pieces of work on the horizon that we need to know about? I, I'm working on a really exciting commission. I can't wait to reveal it. We can't wait to in December. see it. Oh my God, thank you so much for your time, Will. You're Thank awesome. you. Love you guys. See you soon. Bye.